My husband's ship is moored. If you'd like, go use it. Then we shall unmoor it. Can't be that hard to unmoor a boat for four buck strapping young orphans. We're good. <laughs> we unmoored orphans shall unmoor this boat. <laughs> Just like we unmoored our parents from life. No, we're un unmoored from it. Colin, <laughs> do you know how this verb works? No idea. I have no clue. Neither do I figure I, you like moor stuff and then you like unmoor it and then like it's free to. Well, it's it's a restraint of some variety. When are we gonna get like sound effects on this goddamn stream deck button that we can just hit drops in the middle of an LP? Do you want to hit drops in the middle of an LP? Yes. What kind of what kind of if you could have a soundboard, what would you put on it? Um, break his back, make him humble. Um, very aggressive, but very good. And just some of the Brian and Vinny classics, of course. You know, shouts shouts to shouts to my jujitsu teacher Brian Alvarez. <laughs> you know, get yeah, that yeah, yeah, get, yeah. get that clip of Vinny going B. You know. <laughs> B. And a chop. The chop and, and clip. Chop. Yeah, the chop. I don't know where you'd use any of these. I don't know either. <laughs> In practice. I just always wanted to be a shock jock morning radio DJ and then Clear Channel bought everything, okay? Just. Yeah. That's true. I heart radio. I heart monopolies. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, the Knights came all the way out here to be like, hey, have you stopped, are you done fucking around in, no in Podunk Village out here? So the cop, <laughs> like, walked leisurely. And we did all the work, and now he's here to be like, Ah, I have enforced the law. I have done it. <laughs> I have achieved... I have achieved law enforcement. I'm so good at my job. I accidentally took the pillow off of this. just room. broke my chair. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm not doing this. Is that an epic gamer moment? <laughs> I, tried to, I tried to put the freaking... It's just a pillow, man. It's just a giant blue pillow. Your yeah, gamer it's chair. Just, it's just a pillow strapped around the back of the freaking Holy shit. Chair. Um, my friend, Austin what? C. Howe, the professor of Juggonomics. Yeah. Um, I've got a boat. We're on a- Whoa! That boat is fast! <laughs> I can't <laughs> fucking- <laughs> 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 I can't go anywhere, because look what's over here. Fucking boats! A fucking traffic jam pileup where thousands of people died <laughs> in a horrible boating accident that took 40, well, 450 lives. In a perfect metaphor for Law Sphere, we have gained a boat, but we are limited to a very small pond in which we move very fast. Whee! Yeah. Like literally in the second since we have gotten this boat, we have done everything we can. So I'm far. literally a large boat in a small pond. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. Like, at this point, we are supposed to realize that there is nothing more we can do with the boat and then go talk to more people for some reason. Either that or, like, the whole, like, section of Earth here is going to get blown out and all of these weird landlocks are going to get turned into peninsulas. Here, like God a, intended! Come a little closer. I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> you saying God intended for all of this? What? <laughs> <laughs> Was that that bad of a rant? I just don't know where you came from or where you went! Give me that lanky cabbage. <laughs> Long boys. Oh my god. Alright, okay. Stop we got at that our, command base. We got our wallets back. Where we. What were we. What Earth did that distract gate. us from? Uh, I'd probably have to go to the castle or something. Uh, yeah, do we need to talk to the king? Hopefully, if I hit the R button, it'll just tell me. Wow, a message from a messenger. That makes it so important. Fuck! Hurry back. Does that mean something bad happened? We better get to the capital. Oh, okay. To meet at the south gate of the city district. That'd be here. That's right here. Okay, perfect. Is there more memories they want us to restore? No, there's people they want us to... Oh, no, those are the city monsters. Or the city, city monsters. <laughs> That's a human being, Austin. <laughs> you can't just call every person in the street a city monster. If Lady Gaga can say it, why can't I say it? <laughs> My city monsters! Did what, by rights, should be the military's job, and at top speed, too! At least we're pointing out the incompetence of the power structures around here. I mean, you're getting outworked by goddamn orphans. <laughs> hey, they got nothing better to do. The only thing I've had to eat in the past few days is, like, the warm breeze of summer. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> the only thing these orphans have had to eat is the warm breeze of summer. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's talk about an official assignment. <laughs> oh, so we're in the military now. We've been deputized. Yeah, they're like these kids are better than like four hundred of my men. We're already cops. <laughs> we didn't even do anything except get our own shit back. I think FF8 and, made you a cop faster than this. And they're trying to conscript us like immediately. Like ah, someone who's not incompetent. Here you go. Move aside, guards. I am now a cop. <laughs> aye. Aye, aye. Orphan cop. <laughs> That's like the new show, right? Dun, dun. We solve orphan crimes. The Imperial <laughs> Command is trying their best to investigate, but just... Okay, I see your problem is you got an entire fucking building that fell into the skeet zone. <laughs> Do be like that sometimes. <laughs> the mansion of Plana. The Empire's most brilliant engineer has engineered herself into the Jizz Zone. Winger! The, sorry, the <laughs> Skeet Zone. <laughs> Skeeted. <laughs> we got a... <laughs> the Winger. Oh, damn it. You know what? Give we me got, the Winger. We got a boat and I missed a sail joke. Sail! Sail! <laughs> um, Ahoy. They're gonna pay us a thousand G's as a reward for our labors, which would buy us. We walked in with five thousand. I mean, know. Shit. We picked five thousand up from that boar. Yeah. Like this is low. You better get something. We more. literally found five thousand shillings in the stomach of a goddamn boar. You're gonna have to do better. Lock note. Don't be like, woo. We get to be cops. This is great. You need to learn to think before you open your mouth, Lock. Van God. He just fucking hates Locke. To be fair, I do too. Okay, I yeah, mean, no, I, I thought about like, it for five is, seconds. I'm like, yeah, I fucking hate Locke too. This is not a well-written, annoying child who doesn't know things. This is not a quirky individual, a campy child. It, like, This is not Vivi. Yeah, he, he kind of knows stuff and then doesn't know stuff in the same sentence most of the time. This is like a really bad FF9 so far. That's not fair. Actually, that's a really... Broad compare. I'm talking about it because there's like an orphan kid in like a big industrial city, but it's like this thing wants to be Lindblom so bad that it just yeah. Makes, it literally just makes me wish we were let's playing Final Fantasy IX instead. <laughs> this is really a job for Can Canada, and we're just sidekicks. Okay. Yeah, they're starting to get the the fucking pecking order here. You know what Van's done for the team? Jack shit. Nothing. At least Locke has pushed us forward multiple times on misadventures. He was at one point hungry, and then at another point he got robbed and mugged in the middle of a city. What has Van done for us? Nothing. So Just it's been a, a plot. snobby jerk. So it's a stupid idiot plot, and the words of Roger Ebert, where the plot only advances when somebody becomes stupid? Yes. Oh, hey! Uh... Okay, Kanata's gonna make a power play. He says, give me a thousand G's and help me find the memories of my mother. Elgarthe has headed. That's a play. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. No, like, at, at least, least someone's At thinking. least this kid knows how to how, knows how to negotiate. Yeah. I just want a clue to my mother's whereabouts. <laughs> I mean, I can tell you where the cemetery is, kid. <laughs> <laughs> where in the white void is my mother? Kid, you don't want to know where your mom is in the skate zone. She should have the other half of this pendant on her. Cool. Okay. At least there's something. We've got something structural that'll be like, all right, this is why we're here. Kanata's like, hey, Imperial Army, help me solve the case of my missing mother. And. No, that's the booze, not the game. And what? Well, Little of both. Ooh, want some? Little of the booze, a little bit of the oh, fucking a. Uh, someone's got to tell me about Plana's workshop. I'll definitely take some smear off. Yeah, scroll for me, Bab. Thank you. Thank you, my scroll boy. Okay, we're going to the launch pad. That's easy. You know where the launch pad is? Winger. For the wingers. Yippee! 
Yippee! Winger! Winger! God, this kid's fucking annoying. Yippee! You know, Winger! Find the military base to the northeast. The launch pad is at the back right of the base. Wow. Take Thank the you. stairs that go up Holy to the right. Holy shit. Somebody in this game's useful. The, I'm sorry, the ward room? <laughs> the room where we do ward... ward... Uh, I'm sorry. They'll come do you see, want me to, they'll see you the want, big map. Do you want me to come to the wardrobe at headquarters or the war room? He can't come into the wardrobe. He'll see the big map. <laughs> I'm trying to remember the movie. It's, it's uh Oh, it's, it's Doctor uh, Strange Love, yeah, right? Yeah, Doctor Strange Love. Yeah. yeah, no. I, yeah, no. I, I I'm surprised you had to remember what movie it was from. I just this just names. I'm just bad at names. The movie has it's a Kubrick. People forget that it's funny. It's just really funny. That is a Stanley Kubrick, Kubrick movie. I yeah, didn't it's, know it's, it's Peter Sellers, though. So it's like a... You know. oh. It's a comedy because it's it's Peter Sellers. But ah. it's Kubrick, and it, people remember it as like this kind of you know bleak Kubrick movie in some ways. And it is, but it's also really, really funny moment-to-moment -moment scene to scene. Yeah. yeah. Which is, Are we done? Which is, which is the point. I'm just, fuck, is that kind of your fuck idea? Fuck me, I am. <laughs> Next, okay, next time. Next time on Lost Sphere, you and me are going to, like, participate in the battle system. And you, all of us, are going to go uh, restore Plana. The memory of Plana. We're going to save Plana from the Skeet Zone. And next time we're not going to call it the Skeet Zone. Find our mom. Yeah, we'll have a new name for next time. I'll put that as a new save. The White Boy. So we'll see you next time. I love you very much. Thank you for hanging out with us. And uh, we'll see you next time on the show. The game will get better, hopefully. And if it doesn't, we will. <laughs> nah, this game ain't getting better and we're not getting better. That's a promise. We're going to have to, like, intercut this with footage of other stuff. <laughs> like, literally just every time we start a recording of this, it's shit. We'd rather be <laughs> <laughs> We'll find new games every day. Like, could you just be playing fucking... Why don't we just go play some Battle Toads? Why don't we just Why don't we just play Captain Toad Treasure Track? Gotta though? go track some I mean, treasure. I mean, I just I I've really got to unlock some new stuff in Mario Aces, my man. I mean, I mean, uh, Labo. 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 Get your Labo. Huh? What's Labo? Labo. You don't know what Labo is. Everyone knows what Labo is. All right, we're done with this fucking bit. Good night. This has been... Wait, where did Lost Sphere... Oh, there it is. I oh, lost Lost Sphere! Oh, your head's in front of it. I'm trying to get it on screen. That's, <laughs> this has been Lost Sphere. That's been Solon. That's a good game. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> <sighs>